Good morning, everyone. I'm Jared Sitton. I'm a senior D lineman, number 22. I'm a nursing major. It's about 7.30. Just woke up, and uh, let's get ready for our day. All right. I'm all dressed and ready. Let's go get something to eat. All right, and we're ready to go to class. It's gonna be like walking to class. So now I'm on my way to my first class in my 8 a.m. Uh, medical and surgical nursing two. Um, yeah, it's a, it's a nice little walk from my house, but nothing too crazy. Um, yeah, let's go get this bread. Let's, I'll, I'll try to introduce you as many people as I can, but uh, we'll see how that goes. So here I are, my first class. Here's, here's um here's my friends. Hey, Sid, say what's up. Hi. What's up? What's up? Taking a video. You want in? What's up? What's up? Who wants it? You want in? No. Nick, you want in? Say what's up. To, say what's up to everyone. What's up? What's up? What's up? PJ, get in. Get in. Get in. Put your mask on. Alex. What's up, baby? James. You want in? What is this? It's video. Come here, Chris. What? Oh, hi. Hello. Okay, just got out of my med surge two class. All right now we have a little break until our next class. It's gonna be in the same room, different teacher. Um, it's gonna be our community health class. So um, I'm outside right now, just uh, chilling, taking a break, getting some nice fresh air. Um, well, I guess I'll give you all a view. This is Matil over here. This is Meyer. Right inside here is where uh, I'm having my class actually. And uh, yeah, having a blast. Go Bears. So I just wrapped up my first uh, half of the day of classes. Um, had a good day so far, nothing too crazy. Now I'm heading back to my room. Now I'm going to get something to eat, watch it off for a little bit, get into more of my professional attire for my uh, lab later today at 12. So. I'll see y'all in a little bit then. And we're back. Back at the crib real quick. Um, now it's uh, time to get something to eat. And really just chill out until my um, lab at 12. I think in our uh, lab today we're gonna do a simulation. So if I'm allowed to, I'd love to take y'all with me. If not, then I'll uh, just take a video and explain everything that we're doing. But like I said, if I can get some video of it, I'd love to so y'all can see something. Um, they're real cool. What we try to do is we try to give us real life simulations to try to like simulate something we'd see in the real world so we can be prepared for it. Because we may not be able to see it all the time in our clinicals or whatever. But um, in our simulations, we give us really difficult and like stressful situations to try to prepare us for the real world because you can never you never know what to expect so we gotta be ready for everything so i'm gonna get something to eat and then uh yeah i'll see y'all all right and we're back got a little bit of a uniform change here go bears but i'm heading to my uh nursing lab now um in there we do more than just simulations we uh also go over like the weekly stuff. We talk about our experiences in clinical for the week, ways that we can prepare better for the future and what we did great and what we did bad, that kind of thing. Um, yeah, we uh, usually have like some sort of a case study we look over so we, again, we can be prepared for the future. And then also we do our simulation and then debrief afterwards so we can, uh, like I said, be prepared for any situation that we may encounter. So, uh, like I said, I don't know if they're going to let me have the camera in there, but if they do, I'm, I'd love to show you all around. But uh, if not, then, uh, well, I guess I'll uh, see you all later. We'll see. I'm getting in the What are we doing? Take all right, here we are going down to uh, our simulation room. We've got Let's Jordan, get Lauren, Kat. Ooh, it's Let's good. get this bread. Um, all right, here we are in the nursing lab. Here's Kat. Kat, what's going on here? 
So we do a lot of simulations to like talk about what we learn about in class. So this week we were focusing on like trauma and accidents. So we had this man, Mr. Javier, come in with a motorcycle accident. So we were focusing on, you know, um, focusing on his head and any like bone breaks or any other things that might have happened or that are consistent with an accident. So he had a broken pelvis, so we were checking his abdomen and he ended up having a bleed in his abdomen, so. Internal, Internal hemorrhage, yeah. baby. Nice, so nice. So we had to figure that out, and we did. He's Turn alive. Up. Yeah. Saved him. We're just built different. We're just built different. Build different. different. <laughs> good question. All right, we just left lab, had a good day, learned a lot. We're uh, being good uh, student nurses. Turn up, uh, now I gotta get my background check, make sure I'm not a criminal, and uh, then we gotta get ready for practice. Go Bears! Go Bears! Go Bears! Okay, so I just left my background check. Um, I'm not a criminal, uh, but right now I'm just uh, taking a nice little scenic walk through the front here. Nice buildings, good view. Um, yeah, the really a really nice thing about um, ONU is that really everything is like within walking distance where there's really nowhere that you need to drive if you don't have a car or don't want to drive and lose your parking spot or whatever. It being so close together but also so spaced out at the same time gives it like a nice spacious you know area, but also allows you to be able to walk everywhere and uh, it not be a crazy walk. But uh, right now I'm heading back to my uh, house. I'm gonna get ready. Um, I'm gonna head out to the. Uh, I'm gonna head out to the training room early so I can get stretched out, get ready, and everything. Cause today's our first day of uh, full pads and getting to hit. So I gotta get right before I can go and uh, hit people and uh, you know be a nightmare for the offense. So I'll see y'all in a little bit. To do one of these soon. All right, here we are at the field. Here's my guy, Josh Beaver. Davy, Davy, what's up? So what's, what's up to the people? Um, yeah, we're about to go in here. I'm about to go to the training room, uh, get loose, get warm, get stretched out, and uh, get ready to be a hassle for the offense, right? Oh yeah. Yes sir, yes sir. Go Bears. <laughs> All right, y'all. Just got done with practice. Um, I uh, had to, uh, you know, go back to my house, go shower, go change, get dressed, and now I'm about to go and get some, uh, get some dinner, with my friends. So uh, I'll see y'all there. All right, y'all. So I'm just now getting out of the car. I'm going to El Campo, one of our many incredible restaurants we got here at Ada. Um, El Campo is a Mexican restaurant. It's top tier. Um, recommend it to everyone. Um, you truly don't have the Ada experience if you don't stop at Campo. And uh, yeah, so uh, I'm gonna go eat and uh, I'll see y'all later. All right, y'all. I'm back. Um, I went to El Campo, got some food there. A rose con pollo, of course, that's the go-to. And then I had to run out to uh, the stadium because I actually work for the football team also. I work with Coach Compson and do equipment and how we all handle that. Uh, that's one of many jobs we offer on campus. And uh, yeah, I'm very fortunate to have it. And now I'm back at my house. Uh, I'm probably gonna go chill out for a little bit before I go to the library and study because I am a student athlete, student first. All right, just got back from the library, did a little bit of studying, a little bit of homework. Uh, now it's time for my uh, favorite part of the day, go and get some rest. Um, but uh, this is a pretty good time. Uh, follow me on my socials, J underscore underscore sizzle, S-I-Z-Z-L-E 22. Um, I'm team follow back, so turn up. Uh, I appreciate y'all following me around today. Uh, and as always, go Bears.